human creativity has achieved unimaginably amazing structures. From ancient marvels to modern masterpieces, our world is home to multiple man-made wonders that stand out for their sheer scale, engineering prowess, and cultural significance. Here are the five greatest man-made wonders of the world that will blow your mind. Starting with number five, we have the Great Sphinx of Giza. The Great Sphinx of Giza is one of the most fascinating man-made wonders of the world. Located on the west bank of the Nile River in Egypt, this massive limestone structure is a marvel of ancient Egyptian engineering and artistry. Believed to have been built around 2540 BC by Pharaoh Khafra, the Sphinx is a colossal creature with the body of a lion and the face of a king. Standing 66 feet tall and 241 feet long, the Sphinx is an imposing figure with mystery and grandeur. Its human head, believed to be like that of Pharaoh Khafra, wears a royal headdress and a carved cobra on its forehead, symbols of ancient Egypt's monarchy. The Sphinx's face is masculine, with well-defined features that have withstood the test of time. Despite being over 4,500 years old, the Sphinx remains an iconic symbol of ancient Egypt, inspiring awe in all who visit. Its massive paws and leonine body showcase the skill of the ancient Egyptians, who carved the statue directly from the limestone rock of Giza and supplemented it with additional limestone blocks. The Sphinx has undergone numerous restoration projects over the centuries, and traces of blue, yellow, and red pigments have been found on its surface, suggesting that it was once colorfully decorated. Roman author Pliny the Elder described the Sphinx's vivid appearance in the first century AD, writing, The face of the monster is colored red. Today, the Great Sphinx of Giza attracts tourists and history buffs alike. Its sheer size, intricate details, and rich history make it remarkable. Number 4. Taj Mahal The Taj Mahal is majestic on the banks of the Yamuna River in Agra, India. This stunning monument of love and beauty was built by Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan in memory of his beloved wife, Mumtaz Mahal. The design, perfect symmetry, and breathtaking architecture of the Taj Mahal make it a true marvel of human creation. As you approach the complex, you are struck by the grandeur of the main gate, flanked by double arcade galleries and the beautiful garden subdivided into four quarters with narrow walkways and ornate fountains. The enclosure walls, pavilions, and marble work showcase the skill of the 20,000 artisans who worked on this project. The mosque and guest house, built from red sandstone, provide a striking contrast to the marble tomb at the center. The attention to detail is astounding, with flowery arabesques, rope molding, and precious stone inlays adorning the walls and arches. The Taj Mahal itself is an ivory-white marble masterpiece with carvings and calligraphy that seem to shimmer in the light. The ground plan of the Taj Mahal is in perfect balance with the octagonal tomb chamber in the center, encompassed by the portal halls and the four corner rooms. The plan is repeated on the upper floor, with the large double-storied domed chamber housing the cenotaphs of Mumtaz Mahal and Shah Jahan. The exquisite octagonal marble lattice screen encircling both cenotaphs is a piece of superb workmanship, highly polished and richly decorated with inlay work. The four freestanding minarets at the corners of the platform add a new dimension to the Mughal architecture, providing a spatial reference and a three-dimensional effect to the edifice. Taj Mahal is a perfectly symmetrical planned building, emphasizing bilateral symmetry along a central axis on which the main features are placed. This magnificent monument stands as a timeless tribute to the power of love and human creativity, mesmerizing the millions of visitors who flock to see it every year. The third greatest man-made wonder of the world is Christ the Redeemer. Christ the Redeemer is a magnifying statue in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, 
Standing 98 feet tall, with arms outstretched at 92 feet wide, this Art Deco masterpiece symbolizes faith, hope, and love. It surveys the expanse of Rio de Janeiro from Mount Corcovado, a 2,310-foot-tall granite peak. The idea of building this monument to honor Christ dates back to the 1850s, revived in the 1880s by Princess Isabel, daughter of the Emperor Pedro II and the champion of slavery abolition in Brazil. The project was later taken up by the Catholic Church, with Brazilian engineer Heitor da Silva Costa designing the statue in collaboration with artist Carlos Oswald and French sculptor Paul Landowski. This iconic statue depicts the Sacred Heart of Jesus, symbolized by a 1.3-meter heart, and conveys Christ's divinity, embodying the riches within his Paschal mystery. That is, his life, death, resurrection, and ascension. Built over five years from 1922 and using reinforced concrete and soapstone tiles, the statue is covered in a mosaic of thousands of small tiles. The 26-foot square stone pedestal it directly stands on, which also sits on the summit, is said to represent the church's foundation. Also, the statue's outstretched arms, gesturing embrace, and welcome showcase Brazil as a peaceful and hospitable country. Visitors can access the statue by taking an escalator from the base of the mountain to the viewing platform. Since its inauguration in 1931, Christ the Redeemer has become a renowned symbol of Rio de Janeiro and Brazil, attracting millions of visitors yearly. Its historical significance and cultural importance make it a must-visit destination. The Eiffel Tower takes the second position on our list. The Eiffel Tower, standing at 324 meters feet tall, is located in the heart of Paris, France, on the Champ de Mars, a vast public park. Designed by Gustave Eiffel and his engineers Maurice Couclon and Emile Nouguier, the tower was built for the 1889 World's Fair to commemorate the centennial of the French Revolution. It took 250 workers two years two months and five days to complete. Initially intended as a temporary structure, it's become a permanent symbol of French culture and engineering ingenuity, welcoming millions of visitors since its debut. It boasts 1,665 stairs, three viewing platforms, nearly 50 miles of electric cables, 120 radio and television antennas, and 20,000 light bulbs, illuminating it every night. The tower comprises 18,000 iron pieces bolted together by over 2.5 million rivets. The Eiffel Tower stands on four lattice girder piers that taper inward and join to form a single large vertical tower. As they curve inward, the piers are connected by networks of girders at two levels, affording tourist viewing platforms. The tower features a museum, several restaurants, and the Gustave Eiffel reception room, which hosts various events throughout the year. It's arguably the most popular paid attraction in the world, with an observation deck just under the antenna, offering breathtaking views of the City of Light. The tower has hosted countless events, from scientific experiments to historic diplomatic meetings, and has been the subject of numerous works of art and literature. And finally, the greatest man-made wonder of the world is the Great Wall of China. The Great Wall of China has been a marvel for over two millennia. This serpentine bulwark, stretching over 21,000 kilometers or 13,000 miles, is a masterpiece of ancient engineering and construction that has withstood the ravages of time. Built to protect the Chinese Empire from invading forces, the Great Wall was continuously constructed from the 3rd century BC to the 17th century AD, with successive dynasties contributing to its magnificence. The most extensive and well-preserved version of the wall dates back to the Ming Dynasty of 136 to 1644, spanning over 5,500 miles from Mount Hu in Liaoning Province 
to Zhaiyu Pass in Gansu Province. This ancient series of fortifications is a symbol of China's rich history and culture, 